Hello, this is Bitman Plumbing and Biodigester Works. We thank our viewers for continually looking up to us on this channel and clicking on the videos that we have been dropping on this channel. We appreciate your cooperation. Today's episode is also good for you if you really, really want to know more about Biodigester. This method is somehow a little bit exceptional as compared to the previous ones that we have been doing but if you understand the concept of biodigester or what we have been doing you will really get to know this difference and the key concept is that you are trying to separate the solid particles from the liquid particles the solid particles from the liquid when you check our previous videos you will see that we did put some slabs that is the previous concrete on the floor of the biodigester chamber and we also divided the chamber with previous concrete and others blocks but the more recommended one as we said in our previous video is the previous concrete dividing it with previous concrete but I have realized that if you divide it with previous concrete there is no need or it is somehow not necessary to put the previous concrete on the floor because the one which is vertically raised that is the previous concrete is doing the filtration in the digester just have a look at one of the previous works that we have done how we placed the previous concrete on the floor and also dividing it with previous concrete at the same time now we've realized that dividing your digester with previous concrete does not necessarily call for you to put the previous concrete horizontally on the floor and with that it helps you to save some chippings for other works
With this new approach, after lifting the previous concrete horizontally, dividing the digester with the previous concrete, we did not put some of the previous concrete on the floor. So we left that base, that base here, that's between the floor and the first previous concrete. We did not join it with mortar. So you see that it is without mortar joint. With this new approach, after lifting the previous concrete horizontally, dividing the digester with the previous concrete, we did not put some of the previous concrete on the floor. So we left that base, that base here, that's between the floor and the first previous concrete. We did not join it with mortar. So you see that it is without mortar joint. If you love this channel, I would like you to like, share and subscribe so that it will motivate us to do more videos and also educate you on any trends or any new idea about biodigester. This biodigester is taking three washrooms and the owner recommended that we do it with this dimension.